No, we've been. Let's see. You've been wearing this white splint now for about uh, how long? Oh, gee. Six weeks? Mm -hmm. Six weeks. Yeah. So, I mean, uh, last part was about a month ago. And Five, six weeks. This is a upper holly type bite splint with an inclined plane which allows the jaw to go forward. And it brings it into a different position. What happens to your ears and your clicking when that's in? It's completely gone now. You don't feel any. Mm -mm. But as soon as we let your jaw slide back? Then I can hear that clicking when you put your mm -hmm. fingers in there, yeah. When I, is there any discomfort in your ears when, I, when you open and close now? When we take it out, if I can get it out, how do you get it out? You, you know how to do it better than I do. Okay. Now I put my fingers in their ears and close again. And I feel tremendous uh, clicking, yeah. mostly on the right, but on both sides. So she's had a tremendous amount of wear. Put your teeth together in your normal bite in your back, back teeth. There's a deep over jet as well as quite a significant overbite. And we find right here that the two laterals are then the teeth that have held the jaw forward. Then the bruxing problem has put her essentially in a class two jaw relationship. But when we put the splint in, it brings the jaw forward, lines up the freni or the midlines, and it also allows for laterals movement if she wants to do it. She doesn't wear this when she eats. What did you tell me about when you didn't wear it? When you didn't wear it uh, working? Oh, I had a headache. <laughs> Tremendous. It's it's really helped my headaches by at least 75%. Okay, that's fantastic. In the mornings when I wake up, I used to not even be able to touch my chin down. and move my neck out and so stiff, and it's really helped that, too. You I've put got your chin all the way down now? Oh, yeah. But I can do it first thing in the morning, even before I loosen up my neck and stuff. Okay. So it's really helped that. So eventually we talk about putting buildups on her teeth to give her a more permanent position because she still takes this splint out to eat which means the jaw can slide back, although even with the splint out, she tends to hold her jaw forward. Well, thank you very much.